Hi everybody. So I got another haul in today. Um, this is my pre-order from the Stampin' Up! Um, uh, new annual, uh, annual catalog um, for 2017-2018. This um, catalog uh, will be available for ordering from uh, I believe it's June 2nd. Um, so if you're interested in purchasing any of the items that I show or um, what the new items are, you can take a look um, when it is available online June 2nd. And I will leave the link to my um, online website in the description box below if you're interested in ordering and you don't have a demonstrator. Um, but let me get started. Um, they have some really neat stuff in this one. Um, not that they don't have it every time, but some from diff different things. So this is the first um, item I have. This is the Wood Textures Designer Series paper. And they're doing something new if you haven't seen already. They're not putting it in a pad. It's all individual papers. Um, and this is all wood grained and it's double sided. See how pretty that is? Um, double sided paper. And the reason that it is double sided is actually to go along Ooh, look at the distressing to go along with the um framelit die that, not framelit the die cut that they have that is a wood crate which i did purchase look at that they even got the tree rings so this is um 48 sheets of six by six paper and i'm not going to try and put it back in the package but here's the framelit and you're going to cut two of these and you get a star that looks like a chicken a moon and a heart and this little tag as well as the crate so um that is there's this the number if you're interested in ordering that when the catalog is available um i didn't give you the order number for this one this is the number for the paper so there's those two and then there's the uh, coordinating um, stamp set now I did purchase the bundle the bundle includes the stamp set and the die set um, which is cheaper if you're interested in both I just I had to have that farmers market stamp <laughs> and this is a rubber um, stamp but it's not got the wood block so I will convert this over to cling mount um, the way that I do my cling mount stamps so yeah very very cool oh actually it's already I don't think I'll put the um, what do you call it the stickers on the back because they tend to make the stamp fall off so um, that's the stamp and here's the skew for that now if you are interested in ordering a bundle um, of the stamp and die it is a different number um, so just be aware of that when you guys are able to order that the bundles are under different numbers than the individual pieces that I'm sharing with you. I got the At Home With You stamp set. Now this does have a coordinating die set which is on back order. I guess it was pretty popular. Um, so I did get the stamp set and it is a photopolymer stamp. Um, there's two sheets here. Is it the front? Yeah. Now I do have a similar set to this but um, this is a little bit different and I am all for variety. <laughs> I just wanted to have this in my stash. So here is the SKU number um, and it says at home with you. I, I can't show you the, the dies. It is in the catalog, but I can't show you the inside of the catalog either. So um, just be aware of that. Now this is the next bundle that I purchased. It's the lovely inside and out and you can see the stamp set. Again, this is a red rubber stamp, but it is cling. So you don't have to put it on um, the wood blocks. Uh, so yeah. And then here is the um, die set that you can purchase. And, and the different words here are friend, hugs, and lovely. And they're in different shapes. So these are the words right here, but they're um, in different fonts. So there you go. Um, I did purchase this happy birthday die set. There is a, a bunch of different new stamps that have happy birthday in it, but um, obviously 
I purchased this because I like the font on it. So yeah, I'm happy to have this one. But there are there are uh, coordinating stamps for this set. So the next thing I got is the stamp. I'm sorry, the stamp and punch bundle. Um, you can see here. This is a uh, label me pretty, and this punch will punch out the shapes that are in the stamp set here. So I see a lot of them, a lot of new things coming with this one. Um, here is the individual item for the stamp. And then for the punch, there you go. So yeah, um, really, really cute stuff. Again, this one's a um, red rubber cling. So no wood blocks for this one either. That's going to be fun to play with. It kind of reminds me of a label that you would see on a mason jar too. So there you go. And then um, I did purchase the new ink colors. Let me share those with you first. Um, this is the um, Stampin' Write markers for the new ink colors. And you can see them here. The names are... Let's see if they're listed here. Uh, they're not listed here, so I'm gonna I'm gonna give you them from the ink pads. But here is the item number for the um, stamp and write markers if you're interested in those. And then here's the new colors in the ink pads. I got them all: Tranquil Tide, Fresh Fig. I guess I could show you those better, right? Um, powder Pink. Of course, I had to get another pink. Um, Ever the search for the perfect pink. Uh, lemon Lime Twist and Berry Burst. So really nice range of um, pink, purple, and then the, the two greens that are in here are very nice. Um, and they all complement each other pretty well. Um, I did order the coordinating paper. This is the eight and a half by 11 um, cardstock. And you get four sheets of each color so there's the number there and then I ordered some extra of the pink because I use a lot of pink when I'm making things so there you go um, so this is the last thing I purchased well actually it's not there's one more item um, this is the color theory designer series paper again this is a six by six six and it's in a block instead of a um, gummed stack in a book here is the number if you want to order and i really love this stack look at this fun see how they did that it's double-sided and it's like little blocks of color look at the distressing on that and the ombre, and then you get it in each of the colors. Well, actually, not each of the new colors, but um, look at these beautiful blues. And then there's yellow. How fun is this? And then there's green. So this is called Color Theory. So I got that. Um, and I chose the, you know, they have 12 by 12s as well. Um, of some of the paper stacks but I think I'm finding that I if I'm gonna be card making or making tags or something I prefer the smaller pieces of paper just so I don't have all these scraps laying around and it seems to work out for me pretty well so that's the last of the um, cattle new catalog items the only other thing I ordered was the um, wood mount cases these are the double wide um, Stampin' Up cases for the um, wood block stamps. Um, I'm actually not using them for the wood stamps, I'm just using them for storage because I had um, purchased a bunch of stamps and dies that I like to keep together, um, kind of in a container together. And rather than putting the Avriel pockets all together, I put a lot of them in one case or put you know two or three cases in a rubber band together. And I like that um, way of storing things. So yeah, that is my Stampin' Up! catalog pre-order. And again, um, if you're interested in ordering, it'll be available June 2nd um, to the general public. Um, and if you don't have a demonstrator and you would like to place an order, I have um, my own website and I'll put that link in the description box below. 
Um, if you have any questions, leave them down below and I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now. Hey guys, so I'm back. Um, funny enough, as soon as I finished my video, the mailman came and he had the framelit that um, I ordered for the at home with you. And I think there was some confusion during the pre-order process where they had the wrong item associated with the bundle. And so this came separately um, from the post office because my my actual whole order came from US, U UPS um, when it was delivered. So these are the framelits that go with the at home with you. And you can see that you get this cut here inside this larger one, this rectangle is for the door and it will only cut um, the frame of the door with the exception of this right hand side here so that the door stays hinged the stamp it stays hinged and you can open and shut the door on your card wouldn't that be neat um, you also get the outline of the door itself and then you can see here you're gonna get the swag up here um, and the lantern in the present Oh, well, that's probably not the lantern. That's probably this piece right here. Um, you get the little welcome rug. You get the little sayings in there um, for the stamp to put inside the rug. You get the window for the door. Um, and you get the little tree, you know, potted topiary. Um, some of the um, flower basket in a basket. The wreath that you can hang on the door. So you can really change this out for um, different seasons which is really nice. Um, so it'll serve you all year round uh, and not just for you know one time of the year. So that's kind of a nice thing. So I just wanted to share that with you. This is the um, SKU number for the, uh, I'm sorry, this is probably better to read, huh? Uh, the SKU number for the framelits. And if you guys are interested in the bundle, the bundle will have a different number when the catalog is available. So check online. Again, I'll put my information in the description box below as a link if you want to order from me. The new catalog will be available January, uh, June 2nd. Sorry. Um, thanks for watching. Talk to you later.